What's up, everybody? Fatty Maddie here, and I am finally bringing to you guys Demon Souls on the PS5. So I know I haven't been making very much content lately. That's all about to change as I now have a PS5, and I am planning on resuming some series that I've kind of left hanging and continuing on with new stuff as well as uh, doing some streams here and there. So first off, we're going to start with uh, Demon Souls. We're going to go with a new game here. Player's name. All right. Oh, we're just gonna name my guy Matt. We're going to pick, I think, a Temple Knight. I think I'm gonna go Strength Build, just because. Starting gift, um, Providential Ring, probably. So, appearance. We got presets. Wow. They got some crazy looking dudes, I'll say that. Um... I think we're gonna go with... This guy's pretty generic. And then we're just gonna go start changing some things here. Oh, there's a lot more. Okay. I actually like that. Age, we're gonna kinda age him about the same that I would be. We'll just call that good there. Not gonna spend a whole lot of time on customization here. Um, I think I like the way we'll go with that. Color's fine because I'm colorblind anyway. Eyes. Um... Those look good. Looks good. Ears. Uh, ears are fine. I don't really care. Nose. Go with that. Oh, you can do teeth apparently too. 
that's fine jaw um cleft chin we don't have a cleft chin doesn't really matter I don't mind. Get rid of that. Um, no scars is fine. All right, that's gonna be that's gonna be me. Doesn't really matter because we don't really pay attention to our. King Alant the Twelfth, by channeling the power of souls, brought unprecedented prosperity to his northern kingdom of Boletaria. That is, until the colorless deep fog swept across the land. Boletaria was cut off from the outside world, and those who dared penetrate the deep fog never returned. But Valifax of the royal twin fangs broke free from the fog and told the world of Boletaria's plight. The old King Alant had roused the Old One, the great beast below the Nexus, from its eternal slumber. And that a colorless fog had swept in, unleashing terrible demons. The demons hunt down men and claim their souls. Those who lose their souls lose also their minds. The mad attack the sane and chaos reigns. Valifax also spoke of the enticing power of the demon souls. Each time a demon claims a human soul, the demon's own soul is invigorated by the life force, and the power of a mature demon soul is beyond human imagination. The legend spread quickly. Mighty warriors lured by the possibilities braved the fissure to breach the accursed land, but none have returned. The awe of the Twin Fangs. Yet the silent chief. Saint Urbane. Skurva the Wanderer. The sixth Saint Astraea with her night girl Vinland. And Sage Freak, the visionary. The colorless deep fog slowly creeps beyond Boletaria's borders. Humankind faces a slow and steady extinction. The deep fog will eventually swallow all lands near and far. But Boletaria has one final hope. A lone warrior who has braved the baneful fog. Oh, has the land found its savior? Or have the demons found a new slave? Of course we want to play the journey to the Nexus. What makes demon souls so good? Brave soul who fears not death. I shall guide you to the fissure. So that you may lull the old one back to slumber. All right, outpost passage. Yeah. 
I cannot believe how amazing this game looks, dude. It really does look good. We're going to be switching weapons fairly quick, so we won't have to worry about this. All I know is Bluepoint needs to do every remake ever from now on. Because, damn. You know, and if you guys are wondering, like, how I got a PS5, Literally, I called all of my local Fred Meyer stores until I found one. So, I've been searching for one since they came out. Um, when I just happened to get lucky one day and one of the stores had them and they had two. I don't say they had them. They had two. By the time I got there, they had one. So, it was really just... Uh, very lucky that I even had it. So. I love how weighty everything sounds. those were there in the original or not I'm sure they were yeah there is a tremendous difference between ps4 even the pro versus ps5 graphics wise Looks like you can go in there, but you can't. So I must have got a late parry on that one because I did take a little bit of chip damage, looks like. Ooh, a blue knight. And instantly wrecked. That is why we're going to switch weapons here. Go ahead, attack me, buddy. Parry feels really good. Everything just feels really well. Sound is amazing. The controller has some crazy vibrations going on on it. Graphics are amazing. Uh, 
I was gonna heavy attack that guy, but he didn't want me to, so... Unknown warrior soul. Okay, nothing here. Hopefully I can beat him. Wow, those really don't heal much, do they? See, look at the lighting in it, man. It's just insane. I'm just going to get absolutely shrecked. Soul of the lost withdrawn from its vessel. Let strength be granted so the world might be mended. Soul of the lost withdrawn from its vessel. Let strength be granted so the world might be mended. This is the Nexus. It holds together the northern land of Volataria. Thou canst not quit the Nexus. But the five archstones will guide thee to the outer lands. You cannot escape the Nexus. Yeah, obviously. I can't believe how that guy just destroyed me. Well, you slipped through the fissure too, did you? You came for demon souls. Or to save this land and be remembered as a hero. Hunting for demons? Try one of the archstones. Now go. That is why you came, is it not? To this accursed Politaria. Let's see, do we need to talk to what's his name first though? I'm Stockpile Thomas. When the Scuds came, I didn't know what hit me. When I came to, I found myself here in this nexus my wife and daughter fell victim to the demons but i would be worthless in battle at the very least i hope to lend my assistance to you brave slayers of demons i would be happy to lighten your load and look after any excess baggage I mean, I'm gonna have him just store that just because I can't use that right now anyway, so. Rest assured, your goods are safe and sound with me. Best of luck to you. Hmm, you new here. Are you here for my services? The name's Baldwin. I'm just an ordinary blacksmith. It's simple. Just bring me all the souls you can in trade. I'll give you weapons. 
or port the ones you already have. With your souls, I can eke out a living. And with my weapons, you can go on living. Not a bad deal, eh? What do you have to buy? Dagger, short sword? I'm almost tempted just to buy a different sword just to get rid of the halberd, but I'll keep it. No interest, eh? I can tell you're not going to last long here. Uh, do you have any emotions we can learn? Some trade with your souls. And if you haven't heard, there's another blacksmith. Except if you do meet him, not really. No, no. interest, eh? I can tell you're not going to last. Oh my, how has this happened? Has God abandoned us for King Alant, failing to show proper respect? Oh, Mbasa. Oh, Mbasa. Oh, Mbasa. So I am going to play this just like I've not really ever played it before, even though I have played the original. Um, we're just going to go through, you know, just like a Let's Play style, but it's not a blind Let's Play or a first playthrough. Um... I mean, there might be some things different, but I don't think the core of the game is going to be any different than the actual Demon Souls. Um, now the question is, do I need to go talk to the... No, I don't think I do. I can just go straight there, apparently. I don't have to go talk to the ornamental or whatever her name is. The monumental. Oh no, see, it's even locked. Let's see. Um. We can drop here. Is that the one I wanted to drop down onto, though? I hope so. I don't think it was, though. Oh my gosh, sketchy. Okay, so we should be able to... Oh gosh. Renowned warrior soul, okay. Um... Right here. Okay. Let's go ahead and go into Boletaria. We'll see if we can go get the Claymore, and then we might end it there. Oh, this looks so good. the ring on already okay I'm not gonna take any equipment off just yet I don't really mind um, the fat roll Nobody there, huh?
Oh yeah, backstab. Dude, that's so crazy. Pine resin. Nice. That'll be nice against what's her name? Or what's his name? All right. Um Do you guys still fall down the Yep, you guys still fall down the hole. <laughs> We definitely got to get the ring of binding or whatever it is. I can't remember the one that um Come on, give me that uh restores part of your life in the spectral form or whatever. We're going to go for probably half hour episodes. Um I might go a little bit longer on this one, seeing as how it is the first episode and it's got cutscenes and character customizations and stuff like that in it. But ultimately, I decided to go Let's Play series versus uh, a stream, just because it's easier to do Let's Plays. It's not really easier, but it works out better for the algorithm for YouTube. Um, still alive okay and this is why I did not want this weapon because of the walls wow you really don't have much health knock it off you deal hole All right, Mr. Boulder guy, do your thing so I can get my bastard sword. And hopefully I can use it. You aren't strong enough to use this with one hand, however, me. Okay, so we're gonna have to two hand it. And we are not going to be able to wear everything, so. Okay, we can take that off and we can still use it. Seeing as how we have to two hand anyway. That's better. Nice.
anything in here no all right we're not gonna fight that guy i don't feel like dying oh you can still parry this way nice let's try it oh okay or we can just fell backstab you one-handed Oh my gosh. Freaking brutal, dude. Okay, we're gonna go down and we're gonna get the shortcut. There's one, and there's two. There's the cling ring. All right, and that should all be female stuff. So now that we have that, we can put that ring on. Yep, so this is female only, I believe. Does it, it doesn't say though. That's kind of weird. I wonder if you have to look at it in your inventory. I know it's female only because that's... Alright, well, at any rate, we now have that shortcut opened and... You know what? Real quick. Let's go do that real quick since we're not... too far in anyway Oh, it's a crossbow. Okay. I couldn't remember what was there. this area right here so i like i said i am gonna go ahead and try to keep these at 30 minutes um just to keep my videos a little bit shorter for uploading purposes um we will continue right here in the next one uh, and 
from here we'll go kill what's his name uh phalanx or whatever and then we will oh i can actually use this oh wow okay interesting but anyway yeah we're gonna go kill phalanx in the next one so guys uh i hope you liked this video if you did I'm, I am going to take a little bit of a moment to watch it back and make sure everything sounds good and is and looks good before I upload it. But yeah, we are going to continue from here. Um, if you guys like this video, hit that like button for me and subscribe to the channel if you haven't yet. If you are subscribed, hit the bell icon to get notified when I upload new videos, guys. Um, I know it's been a while, but like I said, I am going to get back into the game of uploading videos to YouTube. So thanks for watching, and as always, I will see you in the next one.